Hello and welcome to highlights of the fifth and queen stage of this year's women's tour. 106.6 Welsh kilometres awaited the riders with two category one queen of the mountains points early on in the stage, followed by two intermediate sprints, but a tough day with 2,052 metres of climbing and the summit finish at the Black Mountain. Going into the day, it was Grace Brown in the yellow jersey, leading Cassia Nubia Doma by four seconds and Elisa Longa Borghini by six. They would go through kilometre zero and it was Lorena Wiebes who Grace Brown had taken the yellow jersey from on the previous day. He was the first rider to attack. It would be a short-lived move. It would be followed by a group of 11 riders going clear. They were caught as they headed towards the second Cat 1 climb of the day, the Krubin climb. It was Joss Loudon, the British rider from Team Uno X, that crested the summit to take 10 maximum points. Elise Shabe, the Queen of the Mountains, a leader, would take second. And importantly for her, she put a couple of riders between her and Christine Majerus, who had taken the opening climb of the day at Pont Yates. A select a leading group came together, chasing down Joss Loudon, Ellen Van Dyke, Romy Caster, Christine Majerus, Krista Dobell Hickok, Talita De Jong, Georgia Willems, Marta Lack, Michaela Harvey, Shari Bosoit, Sophia Bertizola, and Shayla Gutierrez. Grace Brown's FDJ team were working hard on the front. The leading group, though, would finally be caught in sight of the final sprint of the day with the Black Mountain just in the distance. It was so tight in the general classification that. Nuvia Doma's team and Longo Borghini's team had come to the front for the intermediate sprint point, but it would be a battle between day one winner, Clara Capone, and the leader of the Pillar Sprints jersey in Micah van der Down. As they crossed the line, Capone getting the better of van der Down with Elena Cicchini crossing the line in third spot just ahead of Alex Manley. It was all about the summit finish at the Black Mountain, 5.5 kilometres in length, averaging 5.6%, but did have ramps up to 21%. Trek Segafredo were looking to try and set things up for Elisa Longa Borghini. Cassia Nuvia Doma had targeted the stage and Canyon Shram had done a great job getting her into position. Ellen Van Dyke, though, was the last rider from Trek Segafredo who was burying herself on the front for Longa Borghini. Her teammate swung off Longa Borghini in the Italian champion's jersey, attacked, followed by Alex Manley and Kristen Faulkner. The Cam's Basso rider Becky Story was having the ride of her day in World Tour Company. Grace Brown, though, in the yellow jersey, was showing her class and poise as the race a leader. Ashley Mormon Passio of SD Works had to be a climbing favourite going into the day. She tried to get clear, but Longo Borghini jumped on her on the hairpin bend. It was a headwind up towards the finish and a real select leading group. Kristen Faulkner led out for Team Bike Exchange. Grace Brown in the yellow jersey looked around to see where Elisa Longa Borghini was. Faulkner, the American, was having a great day. Nuvia Doma, despite gear problems lower down on the slopes of the Black Mountain, had got them sorted. With 200 metres to go, it was Faulkner, Longa Borghini, Nuvia Doma, Brown, Manley and Ashley Mormon Passio that were in contention. Longa Borghini launched her move. Nuvia Doma went with her while Grace Brown was trying to find her way through the two bike exchange riders. The stage victory, though, was going to come down to Longa Borghini and Nuvia Doma with the Italian champion coming through to take the stage with it. Ten bonus seconds heard of Nuvia Doma. Grace Brown, though, importantly taking third place and four bonus seconds. It means, though, that going forward into the final day, Elisa Longa Borghini and yellow jersey Grace Brown now level on time. Brown will wear the yellow jersey on the final day. There's your top three Longa Borghini from Nuvia Doma and Grace Brown. The general classification now looks like this Grace Brown level on time with Elisa Longa Borghini. Nuvia Doma now at two, now 20 seconds back to Manly, 28 to Mormon Passio, while Shabe Faulkner, Ewers, Bertit, Zolo, and Harvey, the top 10 with one stage to go.